Hi everyone, welcome to Jan's page. Today we are going to see a simple and easy recipe scones. So let's go into the video. We need milk, sugar, self-raising flour and butter. All the measurements, please use the proper measurements. Then only you will get, this is a baking recipe. So then only you will get the right uh, consistency and the good outcome. So next in the basin, I have taken uh, butter and flour and we are going to rub the butter in the flour and make nice bread crumb like texture so we need to nicely mix the butter in the flour so that the butter is fully nicely mixed and you it will take a bit longer and next we are going to add the sugar once the butter and the flour is mixed next in that we going to add the sugar or put all the uh, sugar and next raisins raisins is optional but if you want you can add a handful of raisins that will give a extra bit of sweetness to your um, scones again we are going to mix with the little bit of milk little little at a time don't pour everything together because this is like when we make the chapati flour we put little bit of water at a time and then try to make the ball mix together and make the atta for the chapatis so in that way for making the atta for the scone for this consistency you need to add the milk little by little and bring this to a ball next preheat the oven and in the baking tray i have used this paper baking paper that is more easy so this is the normal tray and in that i have just put the baking sheet and butter sheet what you call yeah that and next we are going to take this and tap it the le there will be some leftover milk so when you put little little milk then only you will come to know what the consistency it will come so the total amount is 110 ml of milk but this is 10 ml is left so why uh, so that now the leftover milk you need to brush it on the top see this will give a nice shiny and glowy texture when the scone comes out from the oven next do this with a butter knife and put a cross and then divide it so when it comes from the oven it is nicely easily shared it can be shared bake it for 20 to 25 minutes at 220 degree celsius gas and once it's done it comes out see how golden brown it is and then you can easily uh, let it cool down for 10 15 minutes and then you can keep this and eat it for three to four days um, you know, uh, if you like this video and our channel and if you like to see more baking videos do comment see you again soon in another video bye bye, bye.